was gonna try again. Huh? And I was gonna try again. Yeah, I was gonna mention that with Victor, we saw him kind of put his hand on his throat. If he does something like that, are you gonna react? Or are you just gonna whatever? The the I time of react? yeah, the time of the weigh-in. He's touching. I'm going. Yeah. If you're gonna touch me, I'm gonna fire away. Yeah. Whether it's a press conference, weigh-in, whatever. Hey. Do you find yourself like liking him less as the hype goes on? Is he getting on your nerves more? No. No, you know, you know we're sportsmen, you know. I know I know it's part of this game. Oh. The one thing is when you get mad and you start disliking somebody. That's when everything starts going out the window. Your game plans, all you want to do is just get in there. Ah, that's what he wants. I mean, there's no point of disliking the guy after the fight up and shake his hand. So, you know. Do you think that's worked for other opponents? Like, why do you think that's worked for other opponents? Like, why do you think that's worked for other opponents? Like, why do you think that's worked for other opponents? Oh, definitely. Definitely. It gets these guys out of the game. That's why they, when they go in there, it looks like they had no game plan. Because he gets under the skin. By the way, like I said, everything was on the line. Do you have a strong mental fortitude? Do you think that we're going to do that? Do you think you have a strong mental fortitude? Do you have a strong mental I think so. I think it makes us more fire. I think, I think he... Uh, <laughs> I think he hasn't been in with anybody that's mentally strong as me and somebody that can that can change the pace of the camera.